Hi, this is Trains and Sirens 1, and here is a walk around video and demonstration of my Mall Tutti. So, I'm just going to show you the Mall Tutti before I can show my stuff. So, I got this Mall Tutti from a, from a plant in Spartanburg, South Carolina in September 2016, which was almost three years ago now, I'm surprised. So yeah, the housing was was repainted, but the siren itself is not. So right here is connected to the wall outlet, which is connected to the plug and to the siren. Although the housing does not have the ID tag, so I am gonna uh, take the housing out to show the two T or the siren itself. So this is the Mall 2 t housing and the siren itself. So you probably have seen pictures before, but got requests for the demonstration video. So I'm gonna do a walk around and demonstration video as I do it. So this is the 2T. It actually just got rusted. I'm gonna have to clean it because I have it. It's been outside for a while, serving as a backup siren. So here's the ID tag. Even though it's I don't think it'd be a backup sir anymore, so since I have a new siren which is during little giant, which will be on a separate video of this. So this is a one twenty volt model two T. Yeah, I need to clean this thing and give it some work because this thing has got some rust. I'm guessing what I me mean, using the siren scares the wasp out right there in the nest. So the plug that right there is connected to the steering wheel giant, which is actually right there. So it has its own stand already. So I am just going to show you my setup, which is going to be unique because I, I don't know why I didn't mention this, but this siren, it is current can be Wi-Fi activated which is real cool to show the setup which is in the garage here's some here's the motor starter this is connected to the outlet this is the main power source that the siren is on which is controlled by a motor starter this is connected to the well, this is connected to the wall out, and this is connected to that's the actual siren. So, and this is the smoke starter's power source. This does not control the siren, but just the starter, which clicks up, clicks open, and closes the circuit. Which I will demonstrate that real soon. So, where's the the Wi-Fi? How can it be Wi-Fi activated? I'll show you. This wire is going to lead all the way to the place. Where it is Wi Fi activated? The power source is connected all the way to here. Just a simple Wi Fi light switch. That's what it is. You can buy any of this, any of this will work. Just matter the motor starts and the starter you're using doesn't take so much amps. This was just kind of a little Wi Fi switch. It'll, it'll work. I have no problems with this since that. Although the, the way I have, have my the motor starter set up, the connection is like going loose, so it's hard to keep. If I put something on it, I mean not on the motor starter, but on the wires, technically it could, it could unplug. So, so I think I'm gonna do the demonstration. I'm gonna use my smartphone to do a demonstration. I'm gonna do a growl only of the 2T. I just hope it won't scare the neighbors. So I'm just gonna, I'm technically I'm gonna show a video of me flipping, turning on the siren from the smartphone. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Just gets ready, just gonna show the app. Might give it a safe distance so the camera might doesn't overload. Uh. 
but sorry if I don't hold this very good. I don't. Alright, that was it. I think, so, I think this pretty much is it. Turns out the 2T is going to, the, the stern little giant is going to be replacing this one. I think that's what I want to do since I like the way this wind sounds than the 2T. But I think the mall 2T is louder than the little giant. So, and that's, I think that's what I want to do for now. It works real good. This will be on a separate video. So I know that all these signs right here, they're all gonna be on a separate video. So yeah, I think that's it. Thank you for watching.